Hello and welcome to My Wellbeing. This is the Bridging Task 1 for week commencing the 1st of February 2021. So over January we looked at Happier January and it was lovely to see so many pictures and videos of how you got on with Happy January. So this week we go into February. So it is Monday the 1st of February. So therefore we're going to start friendly February and each day I want you to carry on looking at all the different things you can do. So on Monday for example send somebody a message to show them how much they mean to you. This could be a simple text message, a phone call or even an email. Later on in the week on Wednesday it asks you do an act of kindness to make life easier for somebody else. How about trying to make your own breakfast in the morning or cleaning up after you've eaten lunch for example or ensuring you put all of your toys away. It's these simple acts of kindness that can really help each other out during these unusual and strange times. Task one we are looking at culture and respect. This help, task helps us to understand different people and different cultures and recognise that we are all different and for the need to respect each other and their culture that they come from. There are many cultures around the world that we can learn from. Each country has their own language and this is how we communicate and we talk to each other. Different cultures also have traditional clothing. This represents who they are. Cultures also have their own beliefs and values, such as family, and friends and even education. Cultures will also have different beliefs. Cultures also have different types of traditional food. So this week for your task you're around culture we are going to do armchair traveling so option a remember you've always got option a option b and there's also a bonus challenge this week so if you choose to do option a you will select a country you would like to research draw and label a picture for each of the areas below linking to the country that you have chose so i want you to research their traditional food traditional clothing the flag their beliefs language and their weather so, for example, if you've chose somewhere like Spain, it's usually quite sunny and hot in Spain. If you've chose somewhere like the North Pole, okay, it's going to be quite cold and have a lot of snow. Option B this week, so I want you to select a country again you'd like to research, draw a picture and write a short sentence explaining what you found out. So, if, for example, you chose Italy, Traditional food in Italy is pasta. So therefore, you draw a picture of a pasta dish and therefore, and then go, this is a bowl of pasta. This is traditional food in Italy. However, we eat a lot of pasta in the UK. And then for your bonus challenge this week, I want you to have a go at visiting another country and research the different areas. Then see if you can track on the world map where you have travelled to. So you're going to start from the UK because this is where you're all, you're all at at the moment. You're at home. So you're going to start by plotting and finding the UK on the world map. Then if, for example, you travel to Spain, could you draw a line from England to Spain? And then once you've chosen another country, can you draw from Spain to America, for example? And then you draw a line. So you're going to have lines similar to the picture on here. Going from one country to the other and looking at the different cultures uh, from each country. I can't wait to see how you've all got on. Don't forget to upload some pictures and some videos. And I'll see you soon. Bye.